Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Or welcome if you're new here. One, two, three, let's go. My name is Deepika and I'm a Viscom student studying at Madras Christian College, Chennai. In this video, we are gonna see DG version of college application form for UG 2022. In this video, I'm gonna fill the application form for you guys, and I will also talk about the eligibility criteria for different courses. So in this video, I'm gonna talk about the eligibility criteria. I will fill the application form for state board, CBSC, and other board students, and we'll see the necessary details, and we'll see if they require any eligibility certificate for other state students. So, so this is what will be in this video. So, with all this, more time, let's just start the video. So, guys, this is the website of DGV College, and here you can see the admissions 2022 PG and UG are open. UG application, application for state board students, application for CBSE students, and application for other board students. So, we'll go through one by one. So, first, state board students. So, these are the list of the courses available in the college, aided stream and unaided stream as well. So if you click on the apply, so these are the UG instructions. So make sure that you read through the instructions carefully. So basically, if you have entered any wrong details, then your application form will be rejected. So make sure that you check the application form before making the payment. I have seen many students commenting me or DMing me that I made this mistake. How, how can I edit it? But you cannot edit your mistakes once you have paid the application fee so make sure that you check everything before making the payment and your further communications regarding admission will be directed to your email address and you will see the eligibility criteria for the course which you are applying so accounting and commerce is compulsory so these two subjects are compulsory so you have to enter your 10th uh, register number and your date of birth then enter the captcha and then you will be directed to the application form for 2022 first you will be seeing your shift then your applied course there is option to choose your 12th group code so make sure that you choose the group code correctly so once you've choose your group code then you have to enter your personal information name date of birth gender religion community caste nationality blood group mode of transport and next you will see the specific details like hostel accommodation required hostel is available only for boys select uh, second language you prefer in college and all these details and did your did you lost your parent due to covid 19 you can mention that as well so there are so make sure that you read everything and and choose the correct option according to you and to make sure that you don't make any mistake do you belong to state minority they are asking because they have some reservation quota for these people so make sure that you give your correct details and then you have to upload a passport size photograph and next you have to provide your educational details 6 7 8 9 so you have to provide your educational details from 6th standard 10th 11 12th details your institution name register number medium comment or uh, your institute type your board stream past years and then you have to give your 10 subject details so you have to give your marks obtained uh, maximum marks and your number of attempts then your 11 12 details you cannot change your subjects because you have chose the because you have chose the 12th group code so may so make sure that you select the correct group code so you have to enter your 11th marks your total marks then your 12th marks and your number of it if you click on terms and condition if you check the box and if you click on submit then you will be directed to the payment gateway and then you can pay the fee and you will receive an uh, email from college that you have registered successfully next let's see this cbsc students application form so let's uh, apply for any of the course so if i chose chemistry then you can see the eligibility criteria for chemistry you have to study physics chemistry and mathematics so maths is also compulsory and if you know you're not eligible for the course then there's no need to apply as they will reject your application and if I go to the biology, then you can see the botany and zoology is compulsory and I studied biology in my 10th, uh, in my 12th standard. So yeah, I can apply for it. 
so next is uh, your just registration number 10th registration number then you will see the shift and your applied course and you cannot choose any group code here there is only CBSC and uh, these are the personal informations as we saw on the previous so and these are just specific informations make sure that you don't make mistake your address parent information 6th and 9th educational details same as last application your 10th and 10th uh, 11th 12th details your institution name register number medium board stream past date you can change the board in your 10th standard if you have studied from state board then these are this 10 subject details and your 11th and 12th subject details so you have to type manually your subject in the state board form you have to choose your group code and you don't have to type your you will get your subjects there but here you have to enter your subjects I have entered mine and your 11th marks your 12th and your number of attempts your 12th mark and your number of attempts then if you check the box and you click on submit after um, entering the code then you will be directed to the payment gateway and then you have to pay and, and then you will receive an email of confirmation so now let's go to these other board students and here you can see the other board students should upload correct subject with marks other board students should submit eligibility certificate from madras university so you have to submit the eligibility certificate from madras university on the time of counseling so you don't have to provide it now you have to get your eligibility certificate if you get selected then you can apply and you will receive your eligibility certificate in 24 hours or so and you can see your eligibility of the course so you cannot change your group code you have to type your subjects manually and same application form and uh, yeah photo details and your sixth seventh eighth ninth educational details same as uh, last how we saw and 10th 11th 12th details institution name register number medium board stream past years and then your 10 subject details so in CBC board we saw that uh, there were subjects written and you just have to enter marks but here you have to enter your subjects manually and then your marks and number of attempts and the same for 11 12th details you have to enter your subjects your 11 marks your number of attempts your 12th marks and your number of attempts for 12th standard and if you click the checkbox and enter the code and click on submit then you will be directed to the payment gateway and uh, after making the payment you will receive an email that you have registered successfully so now let's see the read the instructions details and here you will be directed to the page and make sure that before filling the form please go through it once the next if you go to the eligibility then you can see the eligibility for different courses and make sure that you go through the eligibility once and they have provided everything on the website so you can directly go to the website and see and look for it so these are the eligibility for all the courses so this is how you have to fill the application form and the, these are all the necessary details and you don't need any eligibility certificate for other state student right now you have to submit the eligibility form after you get selected after they call you for the enrollment process so and i have also made the eligibility certificate video on my channel so you can check out about that as well so yeah this is it guys for today's video i hope you guys find this video helpful if it did then please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more content thank you so much guys for watching and i will see you guys in the next one bye guys Thank you.